before bringing on the Lipoflow system, we treated dry eyes with all kinds of you know, modalities, you know, we did, you know, artificial tears, we would do prescription drops, we would do amniotic membranes, you know, even in my severe patients, I would go as far as doing autologous serum. But unfortunately, it, it's none of those things address the meibomian gland dysfunction part. And that's, that's why we, as a practice, we felt that we needed to bring on the system to provide them and fill sort of this void that we had there's probably doctors who have it and they sit it on the shelf and don't really concentrate on growing their presentation skills and how they talk to the patient and how they show them the issue. And so you've got to, to continually grow in that, but it's not hard. If you take the time to do the patient education and you explain it to them, they understand the value in it and they get the outcome that they want and that you want and then the practice just continues to grow. I think it's part of the toolbox that we actually use to treat dry eye disease and really overarching blepharitis, MGD. It's the whole entire ocular surface disease spectrum. It really, really is. So, so patients are willing to pay for it, uh, especially if we can demonstrate to them that it's going to have some improvement for them. And so when we can show them their lip of view scans and show them that they're losing glands and that we have a procedure that can help restore those glands, um, patients are want to have the procedure done. And then when we discuss price with it, I just keep it really simple understand the science that goes behind this and understand the work that went in to develop something like this. It's a very affordable proposition. You only need to see about one and a half patients a month in order to pay the system. So it's very affordable. It's a very low barrier to entry.